Hello, my boy. Today we're going to change the oil on my car. <clears throat> Let me show you what we're working with here. So here's my car. It's parked outside of my house. And I have these ramps that I drove the car onto so that I can get underneath it. Here's my engine. So what I have to do is open this and I go underneath the car and I open up a plug and all the oil drains out. And then I put the plug back in and I fill the engine back up with oil through this hole. Also, I have to replace this. This is the oil filter. So I'll show you everything as we go along. Okay, so this is the engine oil. It's five quarts, 4.73 liters. Zero W20 <clears throat> is the viscosity. So we'll use most of that to replace the old oil. Then this is the new oil filter in the gaskets. So this will replace the old one. So I've removed the filter. Just gonna leave it there for now. Take this cap off. I have, this is a, a drain pan. So when I open the, the bolt underneath here, the oil is gonna go into this pan. So, that's the plug where the oil comes out of. And it's gonna drain down into this. Okay, so I'm under the car. I've got these this tool to open up the plug. I have to make sure I have the right size. This is the right size. Ooh, this bolt's really in there. I pushed too hard. Okay, I got it. All right, so I'm gonna take out the plug now and the oil's gonna come out. There it goes. So we just have to let it all drain out now and I need to wash my hands. I also got oil on my coat. 
so I have to go wash. When we come back, we're gonna put the plug back in and then we're gonna fill up the new oil. Okay, so we've got the new filter. I'm gonna install the new filter. Genuine Subaru part. Okay, new filter in. Now we're gonna go back underneath, put that this plug back in here. Okay, so we're gonna put in the new we're gonna replace the plug. It's still dripping a little bit of oil. That's okay. Okay, I got it. That's kind of tricky because it's all slippery from the oil. I'll take this glove off. Hiding it until it doesn't twist anymore. Almost there. One more turn. Okay. Okay, now we can fill up the oil. Okay, so now that we have the plug reinstalled, we're gonna get our filter, our funnel, sorry, it's a funnel, so that we can fill up the oil into the engine. Okay, so this goes here. Add oil. So there's five quarts in this bottle, in this jug, but we only need to add just about four. So, oops. You can see the line is about here, so we still have a couple more quarts to go. A little bit more. Okay, let's see. A 
A little bit more. Just a little bit more. Okay. So now we can put the oil cap back on. Okay, so we are, we're all done. I'm gonna start up the engine now to let the oil circulate. And then we're going to check the oil level from the dipstick. Okay, so I'm gonna let it run for just a couple minutes. Let the oil heat up some, let the engine circulate the oil, and then we'll check the dipstick. All right, turn the engine off, and I'm gonna pull the dipstick now. First you wipe it, and put it back in, and pull it out to get your oil level reading. So we're looking pretty good. It's kind of hard to see, but this shows me that the oil level is sufficient. And thus completes the oil change.